Hello good day viewers. In this tutorial we are going to solve a word problem leading to a system of linear equations. So if you are new here consider subscribing. Press the bell icon so that you will be notified whenever I upload a new content and don't forget to share to your learning colleagues. Don't forget also to hit the like button. Okay now let us read the question. The question reads in a community men contribute p naira each and women contributed q naira each towards a community development fund in a week three men and five women contributed the sum of 9500 naira in another week five men and 10 women contributed the sum of 17500 naira this is just a story but we are asked to find the total amount that will be contributed by eight men and 12 women so how can we solve this problem there is no way we can solve this problem unless if we are able to find the exact amount contributed by each person either a man or a woman so we have learned that each man contributed p nera in the first week we have three of them three men so three multiplied by p is said to be the total amount contributed by uh, three men so we have 3p because 3 multiplied by p is said to be 3p plus in the first week we have five women that contributed q near it so 5 multiplied by q is 5q so we have 5q here but the total amount contributed in nera is 9500 so we have 9500 nera here forget about the unit in the end we can bring it back subsequently in the next week the number of persons increase because we have five men now so we have five multiplied by p is 5p plus the number of women increases as well we have 10 women which is 10 q but the total amount contributed is 17,500. you see we have formed two equations equation one and equation two we can solve this equation by either substitution, elimination, graphical, whatever method you can. But I think we are going to apply elimination method here. Elimination in the sense that we are going to eliminate one of the variables, either P or Q. But eliminating Q is quite simpler because we can multiply this equation 1 by 2 in order to get 10Q here. Once you have 10Q and 10Q, you can subtract it out and it's gone. So let us multiply this first equation by 2. By multiplying the first equation by 2, let me form my second equation here. 2 multiplied by 3p is 6p. Plus 2 multiplied by 5q is 10q. And this is equal to 2 multiplied by 9,500 naira is 19,000. So we have 19,000. Remember, this is a nera. So now we can bring our second equation as well. We have 5p plus 10q equal to 17,500. So now we can, we can subtract equation 2 from equation 1 because this is the same equation 1, just that it has been multiplied by 2. 6p minus 5p is just p. 10q minus 10q is 0, therefore we have only equality sign here. 19,000 minus 17,500 is 1,500 naira. 1,500 naira. So it means that each man contributed 1,500 naira. We can use this amount to find the amount contributed by each woman in either this equation or this equation so now let us come back here um, this equation is no longer in use you can just use this equation to find q this is q all right we have three p has been obtained to be 1500 so we have 1500 plus 5 q and this is equal to 9,500. We just substituted 
P as 1,500 because it is equal to 1,500. 1,500 times 3 is 4,500, I think so, yes, 4,500 plus 5Q, this is equal to 9,500. We can now take 4,500 to the right and it becomes negative. To the left, we only have 5Q. This is equal to 9,500 minus 4,500. 5Q is equal to 5,000 because 9,500 minus 4,500 is equal to 5,000. Now what do we do? We can divide both sides by 5. Divide both sides by 5 to find the value of Q. 5,000 divided by 5 is 1,000 and 5 cancel 5 leaving only Q. So you can see that Q is equal to 1,000 Naira. What does this mean? It means that each woman contributed 1,000 Naira and each man contributed 1,500. So we can use these two information to solve the problem because we are asked to find the total amount that is contributed by eight men and 12 women. So now let me wipe this side to solve that problem. So for eight men and the 12 women, eight men, but each man contributed 1,500. So we have eight of them, eight multiplied by 1,500 then plus each woman contributed 1000 naira so we have 12 of them 12 multiplied by 1000 8 times 1500 is 12000 plus 12 multiplied by 1000 is also 12000 if you add 12000 and 12000 you're getting 24000 and this 24000 is in naira 24,000 Naira. This is to say that eight men and 12 women contributed the sum of 24,000 Naira, provided that each man contributed 1,500 and each woman contributed 1,000 Naira. And this is all I have for you today. Thank you for watching. Do have a nice day.